Chuck, Chuck. Chuck, Chuck. Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. Mike Licio here with you at the Flagler Gymnasium for the first of two games tonight here at Flagler College. Got the Columbus State Lady Cougars and the Flagler Saints in the first game. Flagler comes in 10 and 14 on the season, five and nine in conference play. The Lady Cougars, 10 and four, trying to Sneak into that top spot. They're two games behind Georgia Southwestern in the Peach Belt Conference, currently sitting at third. As we're ready for the jump. Amu Tong out there with Maya Jackson as Columbus State controls into the front court. Freeland Snipes, Amber Abuzer. That is a three off the mark, rebounded by Jackson, and it's a jump ball, possession to the Saints. So a lot of rolls, Maya Jackson, Braylon Snipes, Latia Reeves, and Amber Abusair. In the backcourt as a foul is called. Columbus controls. Rawls into the paint, turn around off the glass, and the Lady Cougars are on the board first. For the Saints, Destiny McClendon, Sherelle McCormick, Dane Bertolina, as she had, brings it up the court. Amu Tong and Sailor Reddick for the starters. Three from the corner from McCormick, short. Saved by McCormick. Back up top. Reddick drives the lane. It's stolen that time by Rawls. One of the leaders in the conference in that category to the rack, and it's off the mark. Rebound Bertolina. Double teamed in the backcourt. Saints are gonna have to hurry. Columbus State with the turnover and the three. That time by Amber Abusair. Reddick brings it into the lane, drops it off to Tong, and Tong's gonna draw the foul. Calls on number 25, Maya Jackson. 
Making her way to the palm line for the Saints is number 24, Amuk Tong. Amuk Tong, fun fact, the only, one of only two athletes I've announced in high school and college. Back when she was at Bishop Kenny, as she misses the first free throw. A 73% free throw shooter on the season. Knocks the second one down and the Saints are on the board. A boost bear brings it up the court. Guarded by Bertolina. Rawls, three. Knocks it down. And it's a seven point lead for the Lady Cougars early here. They set up the press in the backcourt. McCormick pushing it up the floor. Into the lane, stolen by the Cougars. That time Jackson with the steal. A booze bear brings it up, kicks it out. Snipes pulls back and it's gets the soft touch and it's good as it's 10 to 1. Reddick fires into the front court to McCormick. Sherrill goes baseline to the rack and draws the foul. First foul was on Alana Rawls. Excuse me, check that the first, ja first foul was on Jackson. This one is on Reeves. McCormick will shoot two. Sherrill, an 82% free throw shooter, makes the first. Saints now two for three from the line. And McCormick knocks them both down. It's a seven point game. A boost bear in the front court. Kicks it off to Jasmine Ray Stevens who fires an air ball. She just checked into the game. Matt Hauser in his fourth season as the coach of the Lady Cougars. Mo Smith in his fifth as the coach of the Saints. As the referee is clearing out the Flagler cheerleaders. Press set up, they in down the Tong. Bertolina to bring it up the court. McClendon kicks it to Reddick. Reddick out to Bertolina. Bertolina to McCormick for three. Off the mark. Tong fighting for it, she comes up with it and it's ripped away by Rawls that time. And Tong's gonna be called for her first foul. First team foul for the Saints, Columbus has two. A boost bear to Ray Stevens. Jasmine holding it, firing a long three off the mark. She's 0 for 2. Sailor Reddick brings it up. Driving the lane, kicks it underneath to Tong, and among Luke Tong has her first bucket of the night. Four run for the Saints. Five point lead for the Lady Cougars. A boost bear for three off the mark. Rebound at McClendon, she's pushing it the other way. To McCormick. And Sherrill couldn't grab the handle of that one. And it's a turnover for the Saints. Saints with five turnovers early. Reeves fires off the mark, rebound Bertolina. McCormick with it in the front court. Out to Bertolina, Columbus very aggressive on the defensive end. And they're gonna say it stays with the Saints, 18 to shoot. Jillian Bretz checks into the game. She'll come in for Breland Snipes. Referees get together and make the right call. That was Colum uh, out off Flagler. Sixth state turnover, check that, that's seven now. A booze bear in the front court guarded by Bertolina. Drops it off to Rawls. Rawls, deep three off the mark. Rebound Bertolina. She pushes it into the front court. McClendon with it. Double team comes. 
Reddick from about 15 off the mark. Rebound by McClendon. Out in the corner to McCormick, 14 to shoot. Sherrell drives the lane. Picks up the loose ball and puts it in. McCormick now with four points. A booze bear in the front court. 5.30 to go in the quarter. Guarded closely by Bertolina. Stevens with it. Reeves drives in the lane, kicks it back out. Once again, Stevens off the mark. Bertolina pushing it. McCormick into the front court. Driving the lane. And they're gonna call a block on Alana Rawls. That's gonna be her first foul. Maddie Erickson checks in for the Saints. As does Sophia Williams for the Lady Cougars. McCormick to the line for two. Sherelle two for two there today. And with the three point play, the game is tied. A 9-0 run for the Saints. We're halfway through the first, tied at 10. Looking down low, a lot of contact there as they were trying to get the ball into Olivia West. Foul's gonna be on Reddick. So we have timeout on the floor, 4.57 to go in the first quarter. We are tied at 10 here on the Peach Belt Sports Network. Mike Licio here with you at the Flagler Gymnasium where we're tied at 10 with 4.57 to go in the first quarter. Out of the media timeout. How about that Saints pep band, ladies and gentlemen? Lady Cougars to inbound. Rawls, Stevens, Williams, West. On the floor, they go down low to Rawls. Kicks it out in the corner, West for three, off the mark, rebound Reddick. Reddick, Bertolina, Erickson, McCormick, and McClendon on the floor for the Saints. Reddick into the lane to Erickson, back out to Reddick. Eurostep blocked that time by Stevens, one of the leaders in the Peach Belt in the conference. Reeves kicks it out. That's Rawls driving the lane with the scoop, no good. Cougars have not made a basket in over three and a half minutes. McCormick for three off the mark. Rebound Stevens. Williams in the front court with it. Sophia calling out the play. Gives it to Stevens to West. Swinging it around the Reeves. Reeves is scoreless in this game. Stevens in the post, double team comes, back out to Reeves. Kicks it out to Stevens, three to shoot, two to shoot, one to shoot. And it's good. That was very close to a shot clock violation. Very close to a shot clock violation. And the Cougars drought is over. Bertolina pushes it up, Erickson. Drops it off to McClendon. McClendon from 15. Gets the soft bounce. 
and the game is tied again. McClendon's first basket of the night. I don't know if I'd classify it as a lucky bounce. Stevens with the ball, firing from three. She's now one for four, and that one was questionable at, at best. Reddick in the front court, off the screen from Erickson to McClendon in the corner. She's backing down, back up to Reddick. 11 to shoot, nice pass in the lane, Bertolina couldn't finish. Lady Cougars pushing it up the court. Reeves drops it off, the shot no good by Williams. Reeves going up it again off the glass, rebound Bertolina. Dane to Sayla Reddick. She pulls up, in and out, and rebounded by Rawls. Rawls the other way. Reeves pushing the issue, and she's on the board with her first bucket of the night. Sailor Reddick in the front court. Under two to go in the quarter. McClendon pulls up and knocks it down. Four points for McClendon, and we are tied at 14. Williams quickly back up the court. Stevens with it. Back to Reeves. Reeves off the screen. She's starting to warm up. Cougars lead by two. Reeves with four points now. Reddick in the front court. Knocked away. Recovered by the Saints. Bertolina for three. Too strong. Rebound West. She brings it up. One minute to go in the quarter. Stevens with it. Drops it off to Williams. She's calling out the offense again, 10 to shoot. That's Rawls with it on the elbow. To West, four to shoot. Drives baseline, kicks it out, two to shoot. Williams up with it, did she get that one off? She did, it's rebounded by Reddick. Bertolina the other way. 25 on the shot clock, 32 on the game clock. Drops off to McCormick who takes it baseline. McClendon for three. Nothing but net and the Saints lead. 17 to 16. Lady Cougars are gonna hold for one shot. 15 on the game clock, shot clock is off. Williams with it, out to West. West, deep three. Off the mark, McCormick, one to shoot from half court. Good if it goes, and it's off the mark. One quarter complete at the Flagler Gymnasium. Saints lead 17-16 here on the Peach Belt Sports Network. supporter of Flagler Athletics. Virtual and Company, find your home today. And Carmelo's, delivering old world quality. Mike Licio here with you at the Flagler Gymnasium, where the Lady Cougars trail the Saints 17 to 16. Saints shot 42% from the field, one for five from three. Columbus State, 31% from the field, two for 10 for three. Columbus had eight more field goal attempts. Saints out rebounded Columbus 17 to six in that quarter. Dane Bertolina leads the Saints there with five. McCormick and McClendon with seven points each lead the Saints. Five points for Alana Rawls leads the Cougars. We'll check in on scores around the Peach Bell as we go tonight. State softball, which is where you normally find me, took game one against Valdosta. They are scoreless in the third at Flagler Field. 
Augusta leads Lander 17-6 in the first quarter. 21-11, Georgia College over Clayton State in the first. The second about to get underway there, way there. And in the second, USCB leads USCA 17-9. Columbus will start with Bretts, Williams. Gaucher, that's actually let in the back post. So Reeves let Bretts. Snipes and Gaucher for the Cougars. Jessica Dowdy, Amuk Tung, Dane Bertolina, Laney Norica, and Destiny McClendon for the Saints. Reeves pulls up off the mark. Rebound to Dowdy. Cougars trap. Bertolina pushing it up court. Into the front court. And the lefty Dowdy knocks it down for her basket, first basket of the night. And with 9.04 to go in the second quarter, the Saints have their largest lead of the game at four. Gaucher in the front court. Gives it off to Snipes. Snipes kicks it out to Gaucher. Taken in the lane by Tong. Second turnover for the Cougars. Lady Cougars trail by four. McClendon thought about it, kicks it back out to Bertolina. And that is stolen off the Norica pass. Reeves going all the way off the mark. Let follows and draws the foul. First team foul. That one on McClendon, her first. She checks out, checking in for her is Sherelle McCormick. Reeves to inbound on the end line, 20 to shoot. To Snipes, Snipes looking for down low for Lett. Lett trying to back in and gets it off the glass. Strong take there. Dowdy in rounds to Bertolina. And Reeves knocked the ball out of bounds. And Dowdy will inbound. Saints lead by two. Pass in the lane, stolen by the Cougars. Saints have 10 turnovers. Reeves with it, guarded by McCormick. Long jumper for Lett, and she knocks down the long two. She has four points and the game is tied. Bertolina in the front court now. Dowdy with it. Lady Cougars continue to trap. Bertolina as they come, doubles it off to Tong. Three for McCormick, off the mark. Norica fights for the rebound. Picked up by Snipes, going the other way. Takes it in the lane. Knocked away by McCormick, but Reeves recovers it. Off the mark with the three. And Dowdy could not keep the foot in bounds. And the ball goes over to the Lady Cougars. Sailor Reddick is going to check in for Dane Bertolina. Tied at 20, 7.15 to go in the second quarter. Reeves with it, drops it underneath. Fighting and missing that time, but following her shot and recovering it, knocked away by the Saints. Great effort there by Snipes. Be 20 to shoot. And it'll be a side out for Columbus. Snipes inbounds to Lett. Back to Snipes, 15 to shoot. 
Driving on McCormick, tough left-handed layup, doesn't go. Sherrill with the rebound, pushing it up court. Firing it to Dowdy. Back to McCormick. Laney Narika. Taylor Reddick to Dowdy. Dowdy was guarded by Bretts. McCormick with 10 to shoot. Double team comes. Narika with seven to shoot. Dowdy in the corner. And that's money! And Jessica Dowdy with six points and the Saints lead by three. Saints three for eight from the three point line. Gaucher to Bretts who gives it off to Snipes. Snipes swings it back to Bretts. Down low to Lett. Lett spins in the lane. Keeps that pivot foot. Kicks it out for three and off the glass goes Breland Snipes to tie the game. Into the front court, McCormick with it. Quadruple team. Dowdy driving the lane. Double team comes. Fighting for it on the floor. And Reeves able to come up with it. Stolen by Columbus State. 12 turnovers for the Saints. That time, Gachet spins off of Norica and makes the bucket. Reddick brings it up. Lady Cougars lead by two. McCormick to Norica in the corner. Off the mark, let with the rebound. Taken away by Dowdy. Drops it off to Tom. Basket's no good. Cougars on the break. Snipes into the lane, off the glass and in. Snipes with seven points. And it's a four point Cougar lead. Their largest lead since they led 10-1. Double team comes to Reddick. Narika to McCormick, stolen again by the Cougars. This time it's Reeves and she dribbles it off her foot. That's just the third turnover. And we're gonna have timeout on the court, immediate timeout. 4.40 to go in the first half. The Lady Cougars lead 27-23 on the Peach Belt Sports Network. Of the timeout, a booze bear checks into the game for Columbus. She joins Jackson, Rawls, Bretts, and Reeves on the floor. For the Saints, Tong, Narika, McCormick, Reddick, and McClendon. Four point lead for Columbus State. 4.30 to go in the first half. Norika to McCormick. Back to Norika. Laney for three. Laney knocks it down. And it's a one point game. Norika's first basket of the night. A booze bear kicks it out to Reeves. Reeves of four points. A booze bear, long three. Too strong, McCormick quickly the other way. Sherrill slows it down. McClendon. Guarded by a booze bear. To Reddick, down low to Tong. Tong in the post, turn around jumper, a little hook shot, good. And Tong has five points. And the Saints lead by one. 
A booze bear in the front court. Bretts over to Rawls. Rawls to Reeves. Reeves for three. Off the mark. Jackson gets the rebound, though. An offensive rebound for the Grady Cougars. 13 to shoot. A booze bear calling out the offense. Looking to Jackson in the high post. Five to shoot. A booze bear going baseline. Three to shoot. Two to shoot. And that's going to be a shot clock violation. They got that one. Third turnover now four for the Cougars. And the Saints have the ball. Under three minutes to go, they lead by one. Reddick guarded in the front court, drives the lane. The entire defense collapses on her. And McClendon takes advantage with the three. That's 10 for Destiny, and the Saints are up four. Amber Abusebear in the front court. Off the Jackson screen, off the mark, rebound Sherelle McCormick. To McClendon baseline, double team in the corner comes. And Sherelle is, excuse me, that's Destiny McClendon getting fouled. I believe that's gonna be on Rawls. It is, that's her second. Third team foul for Columbus. 22 on the clock, Saints are gonna inbound. Tom couldn't handle it. Stolen by Rawls and she's fouled in the backcourt. That's the second foul for McClendon. Second team foul with 2.13 to go in a half. Jasmine Ray Stevens is gonna check in. As is Aspen Weeks for the Saints. Snipes the inbound. A boost bear guarded by and that is a nice take there by Snipes. She now has nine. Underneath the to Tong, Tong with seven points. Saints lead by four. In the corner for Bretts. Bretts to Rawls, driving the lane, floater off the mark. Right there to get it though was Williams and she draws the foul. Third team foul by the Saints. Fouls on number 10, Jessica Dowdy. That's going to be Dowdy's first. For the Lady Cougars is number 10, Jasmine Rye Stevens. So Stevens, three for eight from the line this year. That's just 37%. Now three for nine. Cougars, that was their first free throw attempt of the night. Saints have taken five. Each team has been called for five fouls. 0 for 2 from the line, but Snipes gets the ball back. 17 to shoot. A booze bear up with it in the front court. Turns the corner. Six to shoot. Five to shoot. Drives late and double team. Long three for Stevens, and she knocks it down. And a three by 10, Rye Stevens. Stevens is two for two with three seconds or less on the clock as Dowdy drives the lane. Kicks it to McCormick. Just over a minute to go. Sherelle drops it off to Norika. But now low to Tong. Tong blocked that time by Stevens. Dowdy follows it though, and Jessica Dowdy with eight points. Second on the Saints. Saints lead by three, we're under a minute to go. A booze bear into the paint, spin move in the lane. Nice shot, but it doesn't go down. Weeks with the rebound. Dowdy with it in the front court, four on three. Into the corner, McCormick to Weeks. Weeks with the long three, and it misses. And the ball will go over to the Saints, excuse me, to the Cougars. Maddie Erickson's gonna check in. 
as is Dane Bertolina. Nine tenths of a second difference between the game clock and the shot clock, 30.9 in the quarter as Gaucher is checked back in. Lady Cougars will hold for one, trailing by three. 15 to shoot. 10 to shoot. Now Gaucher is gonna go into the lane. Kicks it out, six to shoot. Snipes has the ball taken away. Bertolina, two to shoot. Has to get it up. She does. It's good if it goes, and it's an air ball. And that is the first half. Saints lead 35-32. We'll come back with some stats. We'll get you some scores from around the Peach Belt. We'll check in on my beloved softball team. All this and more when we come back here on the Peach Belt Sports Network. At this time, ladies and gentlemen, we'd like to recognize Webster Elementary School students for their support in today's game, cheering on our Flagler Saints. All you Webster students, stand up. Let's give them a round of applause. Thanks for coming out and supporting Flagler College basketball. Line and 
41% from the three-point line. Cougars shot 36% from the field. They actually took 13 more field goals. Turnovers the story in this game for the Saints. 14 turnovers against just five for Columbus and the Saints continue to lead. They out-rebounded Columbus 25 to 14. Columbus, by the way, four for 16 from the three-point line. Freeland Snipes leads the Cougars with nine points, followed by five from Alana Rawls and Jasmine Ray Stevens. For the Saints, Destiny McClendon has 10, followed by eight for Jessica Dowdy off the bench, seven for Amuk Tong and Sherelle McCormick. Scores from around the Peach Belt. Georgia Southwestern leads North Georgia 42-25 at the half. 10 seconds to go in the first half. Augusta leads Lander 32-23. Third quarter about to begin in Millie. Georgia College leads Clayton State 45-22. And the Battle of USC's, USCB, USC Buford, leads USCA, USC Aiken, 35-25 at the half. The only thing the Saints have to clean up in the second half, really, is protecting the basketball. They've outshot Columbus considerably. They've out-rebounded them considerably. But Columbus does such a good job defensively of putting pressure on. They had 10 steals in the first half. Three of those by Rawls, who also leads the Cougars with three rebounds. Dane Berlina with five rebounds and two steals to lead the Saints. Sailor Reddick with three assists as well as Sherelle McCormick. And Amber Abusbear on the other side also has three assists. So we've got about eight minutes left in the halftime. We'll take another break and we'll get you ready for the second half when we come back. Saints and Columbus Cougars men's game to follow this one. Currently scheduled for 7.30. Back in a moment on the Peach Belt Sports Network.
Mike Licio back here with you at the Flagler Gymnasium where the Saints lead the Lady Cougars 35-32. Big game for both schools with just four games left in the conference season. Columbus is one game behind Augusta and two behind Georgia Southwestern for the top seed in the conference. Augusta currently up 11 against Lander. Georgia Southwestern up 17 against North Georgia. So Columbus still has a chance to get into the two seed, but a win by Georgia Southwestern and a loss by Columbus would eliminate the Cougars from getting the top seed in the Peach Belt. Still about 20 minutes of basketball to be played before that's decided. On the other side, the Saints currently hold the eighth and final spot for the Peach Belt tournament. So, USC Buper, who's up 10 against Aiken with a win, and a Saints loss would pull within one game of the Saints going into Saturday's matchup at Buford. So, a win by the Saints tonight. And they could clinch a spot in the Peach Belt Tournament with a win at Buford Saturday. So a lot at stake with the Peach Belt Conference in the next 20 minutes of basketball for many schools, including the two here. Saints outshot Columbus 50% to 36% in the first half, 42% to 25 behind the arc. Saints attempted five free throws, made four. Columbus State missed both theirs, both teams were called for five fouls in the first half. 10 steals to three, Columbus has the advantage there. Saints with a huge rebound advantage, 25 to 14. Led by Dane Bertolina. Destiny McClendon is the Saints leading scorer with 10. Breland Snipes is the Cougars leading scorer with nine. We're about 30 seconds away from action. Possession arrow pointing the Saints way. Columbus is gonna send out a booze bear, Snipes, Jackson, Reeves, and Rawls to start the third quarter. Saints will counter with McCormick, Bertolina, McClendon, Reddick, and Tong. Tong with seven points and three boards in the first half. Bertolina inbounds to Reddick to start the third quarter. Dane with it up top. Over to McClendon. Sherelle McCormick pulling up from 17 and knocks it down. Five points, the Saints' biggest leader tonight. Gets the scoring underway in the second half. Saints shot 58% in the second quarter. Amber Abusebear drops it off to Alana Rawls. Rawls off the screen, kicks it out to Latia Reeves. Reeves knocks it down. Reeves now with six points. Reddick in the front court. Bertolina guarded by Snipes. Deep three off the mark for McCormick. Snipes with the rebound going the other way. Snipes pulls up from inside the arc. Off the mark, rebound Bertolina, her sixth. McClendon in the front court, guarded by Jackson. Kicks it out to Bertolina. 
Down low to Tong. Jackson gets crossed up. Hits the deck. Blocked by Reeves, though. Going the other way to Booz Bear. Kicks it back to Reeves. Reeves into the lane. A foul, a walk. Looks like something should have been called one way or the other. Reddick the other way, underneath the Tong with a fiery pass. And a move Tong with nine points. And the Saints lead back up to five. It looked like you could have called a foul, and if you didn't call the foul, maybe a travel on that last possession. A boost bear in the lane. Just off the mark. And it's going to stay with Columbus State. They have 20 on the clock with eight minutes to go. There's the inbound to Reeves. Rawls into the lane. Spins on McClendon. And Destiny's going to get called for her third foul. Rawls on number two, Destiny McClendon. Amuk Tong with nine points. Her season high is 16 against Augusta last week. Making your way to the foul line for the Lady Cougars is number 24, Olana Rawls. Shoot, shoot, two. Rawls with her first free throw attempts of the night. She's a 63% free throw shooter. Columbus shoots 71% as a team. And she gets the first one down. Rawls now with six points. Second one in, she's two for two. Columbus cuts the lead to three. McCormick in the front court. Dowdy is checked in. Bertolina guarded that time. Double team comes from Jackson and Snipes. Jump ball, and it's gonna go Columbus State's way. Another turnover for the Saints. That's their 15th of the game. Amber Avusbear from Staten Island, New York. Queens native myself. As Reeves is up with it. Nice pass into the lane by Rawls to Jackson. And the Cougars trail by one. Dowdy pushing it the other way. Into the corner, out to Reddick. Reddick underneath the tongue. Pass a little too long. And it's another Saints turnover. Jasmine William, or excuse me, Jasmine Ray Stevens checks in. She has five points. Amuk Tong is going to check out. Maddie Erickson in for the Saints. Seven minutes to go. Lady Cougars trail by one as a boost bear brings it up. Reeves knocked down in the lane by Dowdy. Into the lane, and they're going to call a block on Dowdy on the floor. Dowdy picked that pass in the lane, but Cougars stay with it and fire it right back down low. To Rawls. That was a second team foul. Dowdy's second foul. Laney Narika checks in. 15 to shoot for the Cougars. Stevens with it. Now Reeves with it, eight to shoot. Drives the lane, off the glass. And after the basket, there is a foul. So the Cougars, Lady Cougars will take the lead. The basket counts. Ball is on number three, Sherelle McCormick. McCormick gets called for her first foul. Reeves has a chance for a three-point play. For the Lady Cougars, it's number 11, 
She is attempting her first free throws of the night. She's an 82% free throw shooter, so very good there. And now both teams have attempted five free throws. The Cougars lead by two. Reeves now with nine points. Bertolina across the timeline, 6.20 to go in the third quarter. Guarded by Snipes, 12 to shoot. Norika knocks it down from 16. And it's gonna be a timeout on the floor by the Saints. Mo Smith wants to talk it over. We'll be back in a moment, tied at 41 between the Flagler Saints and the Columbus Lady Cougars here on the Peach Belt Sports Network. Columbus State with the ball out of the timeout. This game is tied at 41. Saints have Narika, Bertolina, McCormick, Dowdy, and Reddick on the floor. A Bear on the floor with Rawls, Reeves, Snipes, and Stevens. Reeves down low, kicked out. Back into the corner, 10 to shoot. Stevens off the mark. Rebound by McCormick. And she gets fouled in the backcourt. And that is gonna be the third foul on Rawls. Press set up by Columbus and they get the steal. Reeves into the lane with the floater. Steal and layup is good by Mattia Reeves. And Columbus continues to put pressure on the Saints. Reeves now has 11, leads all scorers in the game. Bertolina to McCormick. Reddick down low to Narika. Into the lane, turns the corner and drops it in. And we are tied. Laney Narika with the bucket. Snipes in the front court with it. 15 to shoot. A boost bear into the lane. Too strong, but Stevens follows it and puts it in. Stevens making her presence known. She's got seven points. That was her second rebound. Reddick with it. Dowdy. Three, she can't miss. And the Saints lead by one. Dowdy with 11 points. Reeves in the front court. A boost bear to Snipes. Down low to Stevens, double team comes, 15 to shoot, triple team comes. Stolen that time by Reddick. Sail the other way. Bertolina in the front court to Narika, driving the lane underneath the McCormick. Turnaround jumper, good by Sherelle McCormick. And the Saints lead by three. Yeah. 
A Blues Bear. Back to Reeves. Reeves to Stevens on the baseline. Cross court to a Blues Bear. Snipes with it. Double teamed. 12 to shoot. Drives the lane underneath to Stevens. Draws the foul. And Laney Narika is going to be called for that one. That is her first. Fourth team foul. And it looks like we're going to take the foul shots after the timeout. So we have immediate timeout. Saints lead 48 45 with 3.30 to go in the third quarter. Back in a moment on the Peach Belt Sports Network. Saints lead here in the third quarter. 3.30 to go. 11 for Jessica Dowdy and Sherelle McCormick to lead the Saints. 11 for Latia Reeves to lead the Cougars. Saints have shot 75% from the field in the quarter. 50% for Columbus State. The one negative for the Saints tonight, 17 turnovers. Just six for Columbus State. And Stevens will shoot two. Stevens already 0 for two from the line tonight. Three for 10 on the season. Stevens from Atlanta. Makes the first one. Cougars now four for six and five for seven. And checking in for the shooter is Simone Lett. Lett has four points on two of two shooting. As Bertolina inbounds, Saints lead by one. Aspen Reeves in the game. Aspen Weeks in the game. Dowdy to McCormick. McCormick from 20. Knocks it down. McCormick now with 13 and the Saints lead by three. Kristen Gachet back in the game. Brings it up. Jillian Bretz now back in the game as well. Gachet covered by Dowdy. And Columbus State is going to take a timeout. Timeout on the court. So a 30 second timeout for Columbus State. They'll come back with 13 to shoot, 250 to go in the third quarter, trailing by three. Both teams have three timeouts remaining. Points in the paint, even 20 to 18. Columbus State has a slight advantage, but basically even. Points off turnovers, the big difference in this game. Columbus has 22 to the Saints, eight. 22 points off turnovers, keeping the Lady Cougars in this game so far. And when you're against a good team like Columbus and you give them extra opportunities, they're going to find a way. Cougars inbound. Lady Cougars with 13 seconds on the clock. Reeves with it over to Snipes. Eight to shoot. Reeves down low to let. Dowdy clogs up the lane. Weeks with the steal. Nice play by Jessica Dowdy. Dane Bertolina. And they're going to get Reeves for a foul. That's going to be her second. Second. 
Second team foul for the Lady Cougars. Alana Rawls checks in for the Cougars as Dane Bertolina inbounds. Narika with it. 20 to shoot. Back out to Dowdy. Dane Bertolina calling out the offense. Drops it off to Dowdy. Swings it to McCormick. Eight to shoot. Off the screen by Narika. Five to shoot. Sherelle into the lane. Into the corner. Off the mark. Columbus State with the rebound. That time by Snipes. She's going the other way. Gachet back to Snipes. Cross court into the corner. Three for Rawls off the mark. Rebound Weeks. Bertolina in the front court. Down low to Narika. And off the glass goes Lady Narika. She has nine points in the game. And the Saints lead by five. 90 seconds to go in the third quarter. Let up top in the high post. And Dowdy's going to get called for the reach. It's going to be Jessica's third. Balls on number 10, Jessica. Sophia Williams will check in. Sophia transferred from Chico State. And Lett is going to go to the line as the Saints are in the bonus. First one off the mark for Lett, who is a 74% free throw shooter. Excuse me, that one in. 74% free throw shooter. She's one for one here. Six for eight for Columbus State. They knock them both down. And some substitutions. Olivia West for the Cougars. Sailor Reddick from Jacksonville for the Saints. 127 to go in the third. Saints bring it up, leading by three. Bertolina double team. Up high to Reddick. Back to Bertolina. Kicked ball as Williams got in the passing lane. Saints will inbound from the sideline with 20 to shoot. Bertolina inbound. And then the backcourt to Reddick. Sela to Sherrell. Down low to Narika. 12 to shoot. Reddick with it in the lane. Drops it out to Bertolina. Dowdy with five to shoot. Into the lane. Three to shoot. Reddick with one to shoot. And she gets the basket. Sayla Reddick. Sayla Reddick. With her first basket of the night. Williams down low to Let. Let double team. Back in Narika down. Too strong. Rebounded by Reddick to Bertolina. One second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Dowdy off the mark. Rebound McCormick. And she's going to go to the line for two. Sherrell McCormick with the defensive rebound. Offensive rebound, rather. Sherelle, three for three on the line today. And the Cardinal Gibbons graduate knocks down the first one. 22 seconds left on the clock. As the second one goes down, Saints lead is seven. That's their largest of the game. Fifteen to shoot as Williams brings it up. West with it. Nine to shoot. Into the lane. Finds an opening. Off the mark. Narika with it. Five to shoot. Trapped in the backcourt. Bertolino with it. One to shoot. And it's blocked to end the quarter by West. But with ten minutes to play, the Saints lead the Lady Cougars 56-49. Seven-point lead for the Saints. Back for the fourth quarter in just a moment. 
This is Mike Licio on the Peach Belt Sports Network. The Big Cat is on the floor. As Lewis struts his stuff, Mike Licio here with you at the Flagler Gymnasium on a cold night in downtown St. Augustine. Saints softball trails 4-1 in the top of the sixth, trying to sweep Valdosta State. Around the league, North Georgia trails 60-34 against Columbus against Georgia Southwestern going into fourth. Going into the fourth, 52-39, Augusta Overlander. Eight minutes to go, Georgia College leads Clayton State 61-44. And Aiken making a run is closed at the six in the fourth quarter against Buford. Here, Dane Bertolina is up with it to McClendon. McClendon, Bertolina, Norica, McCormick who has the ball and Reddick for the Saints to start the fourth. Off the mark for McClendon, another rebound for Sherelle McCormick. Out to Bertolina for three and she's got it! Double digit lead for the Saints! Williams, Rawls, Bretz, Lett, and West on the floor for the Lady Cougars. Deep three! Off the back of the rim, rebounded by Bertolina. Dane up the court, drops it to McClendon, into the lane, blocked that time by Williams. Quickly rolls the other way. Pulls up in the lane, tough floater, doesn't go. Rebounded by Bertolina. Dane Bertolina now with eight rebounds. Reddick back out to Bertolina. McClendon loses the handle. Goes down and gets it. Bertolina with 15 to shoot. Now 10 to shoot for Bertolina. Drops it off to McCormick. Seven to shoot. Sherrill sizing it up. Fires off the mark. Rebound Reddick. Saints have dominated the class tonight. 34 to 20. Slowing it down. 12 to shoot. Sailor Reddick to Sherrill McCormick. Sherelle off the glass, no good. Rebound let. Simone kicks it out to Rawls in the front court. Williams back to Rawls. Let from 18 off the mark as Williams follows it and gets the rebound. Underneath to West, and it's good. Columbus State has a 9 8 advantage on the offensive glass as Narika is up with it in the front court. Laney back out to McCormick. Saints lead by eight. Under eight to go. Sailor Reddick slowing it down. McCormick with 12 to shoot. Excuse me, McClendon with 12 to shoot. Now nine to shoot. Destiny in the lane. Bertolina for three. Off the mark, rebound Williams. Sophia in the front court. Driving the lane with the scoop. That was an offensive rebound by Snipes. Excuse me, that was Rawls with the offensive rebound. A lot of contact there. I believe that's gonna be a foul against the Saints. And it is, it's the first team foul. That's number four for McClendon, who has 10 points tonight. She's gonna to go to the bench. Actually, McCormick's going to go to the bench. And McClendon's going to stay out there with four fouls. She needs to be careful. Stevens in the game. Rawls with it. 
Over to Latire Reeves. Nine to shoot. Steps into the lane. Tough basket, doesn't go. Rebound to Narika. Bertolino with it now. Seven minutes to go. Saints up by eight. Dane across the timeline, knocked out by Reeves. Lady Cougars have had quick hands all night. They have 12 steals. And off with the whistle, they're going to get McCormick or McClendon out of the game, joining McCormick. Reddick with it, 14 to shoot. Dowdy to Weeks. Narika with eight to shoot. Long two. Lady Narika. Lady with 11. And the Saints lead back up to 10. Reeves in the front court. Twelve to shoot. Driving the lane off the glass and count it. Latire Reeves, second leading scorer in the Peach Bell Conference, gets the basket. That foul is on Weeks, her first. Second team foul for the Saints, and Reeves will go back to the line for two. Eleven points, a new high for Lady Narika. Reeves knocks it down to complete the three-point play. She's two for two from the line. She has 14 in the game. Weeks to Dowdy in the corner. Dowdy hesitates, knocks it down! Jessica, Jessica Dowdy with 14! Saints back up 10. Latia Reeves, and that is a charge! Taken by Weeks, it's going the other way. Foul on Reeves, her third. First team foul for the Cougars. Williams checks out. A booze bear checks in for the Cougars. Bertolina inbound. Cougars setting up the press. Inbound it's a Redick. Across the timeline. Out to Bertolina. Wide open three. Off the mark, but Tong is there. Taken away by Rawls. A lot on the other way. To Latia Reeves for three. It's short. Rebound at Weeks. Reddick in the front court. To Dowdy in the corner. Back to Bertolina. Dane pulls up. Sela. Back out to Bertolina, 15 to shoot. Tries to drop it down, it's a kick ball. Saints will retain possession. Norika is going to check in along with McCormick. Tong and Reddick check out. They put 20 back on the clock for the Saints, 5.18 to go, they lead by 10. Bertolina with it. Off to McCormick, and Rawls will switch. 10 to shoot. Sherelle backing her down. Off the front of the rim, no good. Rebound that time by Rawls in the front court. Snipes, size and weeks up. Kicks it out to the corner. A boost bear. Off the mark, rebounded by Dowdy. Jessica's going to slow it down and get it to Bertolina. Dane in the front court. Under five to go. Saints lead by 10. Norika with it, 15 to shoot. Drops it down to McCormick. With Rawls in the post, faces up, no good. Rebound Stevens. 4.30 to go, a boost bear with it. Three for Snipes. Rebound to Norika. Lady's third rebound. Weeks in the front court, drives the lane, kicks it out. Lady from 15, and Lady's on fire. 13 points for Lady Narika. Matt Hauser wants to talk it over. Saints lead by 12 with 4-12 left in the fourth quarter. Back in a moment on the Peach Belt Sports. No, we'll keep it here. It's a 30-second timeout. 
We'll get some scores from around the Peach Belt. Buford leads 52-46 over Aiken. Georgia College in control over Clayton State, 68-51 in the fourth. Augusta rolling Lander 60-41 in the fourth, and North Georgia up 26 against, or down 26 against Georgia Southwestern. A new career high for Lady Narika with 13. Sherelle McCormick leads the Saints with 15, followed by 14 for Dowdy, 13 for Narika. Amu Tong with nine. For the Lady Cougars, Latia Reeves with 14. Stevens with nine. Snipes with nine. Followed by Rawls with seven. Saints have out-rebounded Columbus State 41 to 26. That's the big stat in favor of the Saints. Columbus State with 14 more points off turnovers. Cougars have a lot of work to do. A loss here would give them a chance at second at best in the Peach Belt Conference Tournament as they would not be able to catch Georgia Southwestern. Latia Reeves to three. Off the mark, Narika with the rebound. And crashing in, and I think she's going to get called for the foul is Snipes. It's going to be the second team foul on Columbus State. Saints get the ball with a fresh 30. First foul on Snipes. Lady Cougars set up the press as McCormick has it. Under four to go, Saints lead by 12. Dane Bertolina directing traffic. Guarded by Snipes. She switches off to follow McClendon. McCormick with it. Sherelle would tend to shoot. Norika with it. Into the lane. And Laney has it again. 15 for Laney. 14 point lead for the Saints. As she is now tied with Sherelle McCormick for the team lead. McCormick seems to have her best games when I'm here. I love it. That was a tough shot by Rawls and she gets it down. Ends a 7-0 Saints run. Trap in the backcourt. It's going to be a jump ball and it's going to go to Columbus State. West in the game for the Cougars. A boost bear to inbound to Reeves. A full 30 on the clock. She drives the lane. McClendon has to back off. It's short, but put back by Snipes. Cougars cut it to 10. 2.45 to go. Dane Bernalino across the timeline. West, Reeves, Snipes, Abuse Bear, and Rawls on the floor for the Cougars. McClendon, McCormick, Narika, Dowdy, and Bertolina for the Saints. Seven to shoot. Sherelle from downtown! And it's getting late early in St. Augustine for the Lady Cougars. Timeout on the floor. Saints lead by 13. McCormick has 18. We'll be back in a moment here on the Peach Belt Sports Network. Saints in the lead. If they can hold on, 
I'm going to remind Mo Smith that the Saints would now be 5-1 and one when I call their games, the Lady Saints. A booze bear in the front court. Cougars need buckets. A booze bear with it. 20 to shoot. Short. West, another offensive rebound. Lady Cougars have been very good on the offensive class. Off the rebound by Bertolina as that shot was off. Bertolina in the front court. They trap. Reddick with it. McCormick, Narika, McClendon, Reddick, and Bertolina for the Saints. McCormick to McClendon. Norica with it, guarded by West. Reddick drives the lane. Off the glass and in. Sailor Reddick puts the Saints up 15 with 90 seconds to go. A booze bear out to the corner for West. Off the mark, another offensive rebound for Columbus State. Rolls for three. That's a big three. And Columbus State's going to take a timeout. It's a 12-point game with 117 left. 12-9 advantage for Columbus State on the offensive class today. Saints have out-rebounded them 34-16 to on the other side, though. And 43-29 for the game. Saints up 12 despite 19 turnovers in the game. Fourteen steals tonight for the Cougars. They've shot just 34% from the field. Five for 25 from the three-point line. Saints are shooting 54% from the field, 43% from the three-point line. Free throws, Columbus is eight for 10, Saints six for seven. Press set up by the Lady Cougars. Inbound to McClendon, double team comes. Bertolina with it. Cougars have three fouls to give. Into the front court for Reddick. Sailor with it, 19 to shoot. A booze bear guarding her like a hawk. And one for Sherelle McCormick. Make it 20 on the night. Rawls is going to have her fourth foul. Something to keep an eye on. McCormick, five for five from the line. Has 20. Make it 21, Blackjack. 15 point lead for the Saints, 60 seconds to go. A booze bear picks it up quickly. West in the front court. Amber a booze bear. A lot of rolls. Reeves from the corner. Too strong, rebound McCormick. And now the Lady Cougars will have to start fouling. Cougars still with two fouls to give, or one foul to give. And then the Saints will start shooting after the next, in two fouls. Mo Smith wants to talk it over real quick. So let's reset. Saints have one timeout. Cougars have one timeout. Cougars have one foul to give. Saints have two. If this result holds, Saints would improve to six and nine, but would stay behind Georgia College for that last spot. Georgia College is up 14 against Clayton State right now. But they would, actually we've got some, we have to keep a close eye on this game. Aiken has cut it to one point. With a Buford loss and a Saints win, Saints would clinch a spot in the Peach Bell Tournament with a win Saturday. McClendon is fouled. She's going she's gonna to be on the floor. There's one more foul. So next foul, the Saints will be shooting. So if Buford loses, they fall to 3-12. and 12. Saints would go up 3 with 3 to play and would clinch a spot in the Peach Bell Tournament with a win on Saturday. Reddick with it. 15 to shoot, 32 in the game. And Columbus is not gonna foul, 10 to shoot. Bertolina in and out. 
Aiken with the ball, watching the Aiken game, pulling to Kevin Harlan, looking at both games, rebound for the Saints, and a foul. 10.7 seconds left, Buford leads Aiken, 56-55. Fouls on number three, Amber Obenspare. Stepping to the foul line for the Saints is number 11, Lady Norica. Lady Norica with a career high tonight. She'll shoot two. A 15. Knocks the first one down. She has 16 now. Lady now just three for it was three for two for seven coming into the game at the line. She's three for eight. Off the mark, ten seconds to go. Timeout at Aiken. And Columbus State's gonna dribble it out. Saints get the win. Columbus State falls to ten and five in Peach Bell play. Aiken with the ball, eight seconds left. Ball gets away, six seconds left. Four seconds left. Aiken fires up at the buster off the glass, no good, Buford wins. No matter though, Saints can clinch a spot in the Peach Bell Tournament at Buford on Saturday. They win here 77-61, near 11 and 14 on the year. Six and nine in conference play. Final score, Saints 77. Sherelle McCormick with 21. 16, a career high for Lady Narika. 14 for Jessica Dowdy. Latire Reeves led the Cougars with 14. From the Flatter Gymnasium, this is Mike Licio back for game two in just a moment. Final score, 77-61. Saints win on the Peach Belt Sports Network.